All right, so yesterday we played this game, uh, made it uh, a little bit into the mansion area. Uh, for one, the recording came out pretty shitty. Uh, the volume was really low on my voice. And two, I played really shittily. So I want to start over. Resident We're going to start from the beginning. Zero. We'll watch the cutscene again. Why not? A Midwestern town in America. Raccoon City. A solitary island far off in the sea. Rockfort Island. An island that would become the second Raccoon City. Sheena Island. There are still many unanswered questions about these seemingly unrelated yet intensely traumatic events. Though it is believed that the International Enterprise Umbrella was somehow involved, little is known as to the origin of this faceless corporation. When was it established? By whom? And how was the T-Virus created? To uncover the truth, we must delve deeper into the events which transpired in the beginning, before the mansion incident. Think so too. Yeah. Do about it. Forbidding dialogue. as a simple investigation of some bizarre murders in the suburbs of Raccoon City. Nothing in our training could ever have prepared us for the nightmare that ensued. We never stood a chance. What's going on? Engine failure! Emergency landing! It's not a situation Check that the deserves a thumbs up. Investigate the surrounding area. Captain, look. <gasps> Captain. Hmm? What happened? Somebody jerk off onto that car. Court order for transportation. Prisoner Billy Cohen, ex-lieutenant, 26 years old. Court martialed and sentenced to death July 22nd. Prisoner is to be transferred to the Regathon base for execution. Those poor soldiers. They were good men just doing their jobs. And that scum murdered them and escaped. All right, everyone. Let's separate and survey the area. Our friend is brutal and ruthless. Keep your guard up.
Okay. So here we are again. Back on the train. So I think the train is the best part of this game. It's all downhill from here. This is Officer Chambers from Stars Bravo Team. Please identify yourself. Is someone there? The government has announced that we have set up a plant on the common. But as of two years ago, when a cellular plant was set up, the local government stepped in and took all the Zombies have like a hundred boys. Hold on, I'll get caught reloading. What just happened? I, I thought they were dead. Pretty sure you don't have to kill them, but you get a you get that cutscene if you do. All right. Can we go in here? Yes. <clears throat> Even though I just said this yesterday, my memory is hazy, so... We're not gonna get stuck as much. But I'm probably still gonna... Forget a lot of things. Handgun ammo... I'll, I'll reread everything. We'll pretend like this is still my first playthrough. Passenger's Diary, July 14th. Orders came from the boss today. Looks like we're in charge of investigating the remains of the Arclay Mountains Laboratory. We're moving in two groups. The initial group is assigned to start checking what's left of the abandoned experiment. July 16th. Unfortunately, the test production of BOW Type Y139 had to be suspended because of this investigation. It's the same with Type Y139. There's still so much we don't know about responses to the Crustacean T-Virus. There's a lot of interesting research labs. Depending on the species and nurturing conditions, only minute di doses of T bring about remarkable changes in solidity, size, multiplication of internal toxins, and brain development. If these effects can be controlled, a powerful weapon can be produced. But the sudden development of the shell results in a corresponding fragility. Certain areas become exceedingly weak. Problematically, the, one of these areas in the head is the head carapace. The lab we were going to, were they pursuing the same research? It would certainly help to find data and samples that would help us in our research. July, God, they, so much. The day is finally approaching. I am growing more anxious. The Raccoon City newspaper and TV stations are full of reports about the bizarre murders in the suburbs. It can't be the virus, can it? If it is, dot, dot, dot. No. I can't think of that now. I have to concentrate on this investigation and make sure it goes smoothly. The diaries are so long in this game. Nice top hat. Jackass. Anything? And this is the save room. We'll go ahead and save. Leave this in here. Like I said, well, like what I yesterday, uh, you can, uh, I'm not gonna write over that, I'll save that, just for, just for memory's sake. So I can always look back and be like, haha, look how terrible I did. But yeah, in this game, you can drop items, you don't have to take them with you, you don't have to put them on, uh, in item box, which sucks, I prefer the item box way of doing things.
Billy. Lieutenant Cohen. So, you seem to know me. Been fantasizing about me, have you? You're the prisoner that was being transferred for execution. You were with those soldiers outside. Oh, I see. You're with stars. Well, no offense, honey, but your kind doesn't seem to want me around, so I'm afraid our little chat time is over. Wait! You're under arrest! No thanks, dollface. I've already worn handcuffs. I could shoot, you know. He just dove head first in the window. Zombies and monsters. Uh, uh. <laughs> Doggos. So we go all the way back, and I'm pretty sure there's gonna be a ton of zombies. Okay, let's see if we can get around this guy. Oh no, okay, we're good. We will have to kill them eventually, though. Rebecca, over. Enrico, hello. Can you read me? Hello. Please respond. Rebecca, I can hear you. Now listen up. We've obtained detailed information on the fugitive from a document found in the wrecked wagon. Billy Cohen killed as many as twenty-three people. Over. Twenty-three people. We've also confirmed that he was institutionalized, so keep your guard up. Can you hear me, Rebecca? Over. Stay alert, Rebecca. He wouldn't think twice before killing you. Enrico! Captain! Hello? 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 Says hello with a U. dangerous from here on in. Why don't we cooperate? Cooperate with you? Listen, little girl, if you haven't noticed, there's some pretty freaked out what things a lame this tattoo. Train. And I, for one, want to get out of here. I don't think we stand a chance doing it alone. You expect me to trust you, a wanted felon? I don't need your help. I can handle this on my own. And don't call me little girl. <laughs> All right, Miss Do-It-Yourself. What should I call you? The name is Rebecca Chambers, but that's Officer Chambers to you. Well then, Rebecca, why don't you go and try while I wait here? Okay, so... I don't think I read this last time. When closing the dining car, supervisors are asked to switch off to automatic doors after ensuring all staff have vacated the car. The main automatic door power switch is located on the roof of the fifth car. And, oh my god, inspections will take place when the train is garage. Why would they put it up there? 
After inspections are complete, you use the ladder at the rear of the second floor of the dining car. Umbrella Corporation Maintenance Department. Excuse me, sir. Sir. Why would you assume he was alive? Yeah, we don't have to fight this thing, we can run down here. And Billy gets his badass moment. Check this shit out. Die really necessary for two slimes, two legions. Who is that guy? Check out the first engine car. Listen, we've got to cooperate with each other from now on. You got that? Well, I don't. Clue in, girl. Or maybe you like being worm bait. All right. But you just remember, I will shoot you if you try anything funny. Fine. Now take these with you. If you find anything, give me a call. All right? here and this is absolutely ridiculous there's no way in hell you could walk on top of a moving train going at this speed at least not without crawling. Okay, so I'm gonna walk over here. Check this out. Four kids coming pop up. Becca's gonna be stuck in here for a while by herself. We will take all the goodies we can. And we're gonna take this train key. I don't know why this contraption would exist. Send this down. Yes. And switch over to Billy, who is still standing on top of a moving train. Now he's walking with the wind. 
but still managing to keep his balance. So basically, Billy is going to be the character we'll be playing as the most, and Rebecca is going to be the pack mule. She's going to carry all our shit for us. Billy's going to be the arsenal. Because Billy can take way more hits than Rebecca. Rebecca gets bit once and she's down on caution. Oh wait, I forgot to grab that. E. There is a mod to skip these doors, but I didn't bother downloading it. Uh, I have the one for uh, Resident Evil 1 Remake. But I just didn't bother downloading this one because it's, this is my first playthrough in a while. I haven't played this game since I was a kid. Well, I mean, I've played it here and there, but I haven't beaten it since I was a kid. I used to play this game all the time when I was a kid. This isn't that great of a game. This is actually one of the, um, I don't want to say worst Resident Evil games, but it's certainly not one of the best. Oh, damn it. But I used to love it when I was a kid, when it first came out. I was about 11 years old. So that was like 20 years ago, 20-something years ago. Go down. Should have got some ammo from Rebecca. Let's go save. It's not gonna do us much good. I did men's kill a zombie with with it yesterday, and I got an achievement for it. Uh, did I even go the right way? Oh, here we go. Yeah, I did. got some herbs here, but only Rebecca can mix them. Anything else? Oh yeah, we get this. And I would love some ammo. What is this? Oh, I didn't even get this last time. The key card for the driver's compartment is in my bag, as always, but I need the other guy's key to open the damn thing. But it looks like I've lost it somewhere. If it was a normal key, someone would be sure to turn it in, but this key is different. I'll look for it too. If you happen to find it, please hand it in. Thanks in advance. That's a pretty cool visual. Oh no, I wanted the map. The map, the map. I don't know if I'm going to have enough ammo for this boss. I should have sent down the ammo from Rebecca.
fact, I don't know, I might go do that. If there's no ammo in here, I might go do that. I might go run back and grab that ammo. Because this boss doesn't trigger unless you grab this. So we're going to leave that there. We do have some ammo. Please be a lot. How much was it? 30. Okay, that, that should be good. Uh, we'll leave that there. Damn. Damn, damn, there's a lot of good stuff in here. Fuck me. Uh, shit. Okay, I'm gonna run back to the save room. Take that with me. Is that shotgun shells? I didn't even see those last time. I'm gonna run back to the save room. And drop all this shit off and then come back, grab the shotgun. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna leave the first aid spray. But I'm gonna take the ink ribbon. Because I might need that first aid spray. That's a this boss. I know I'm backtracking, but that's, uh, that's Resident Evil for you. If I knew what I was doing, I wouldn't have to backtrack, but I don't know. I mean, I know what I'm doing right now. But in general, I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, we gotta fight some zombies along the way. But it'll be okay. I'll get Rebecca to send down that ammo. I see, did he? Does he have anything on him? Oh, he does have ammo, that's right. So we are good to go. I'll have to kill these guys at some point anyway. Got it? I think there's one more, right? the save room. The save room is way back there. But whatever. Did I even, is there even 
Is there more in there? No. So, we're good. We have a hundred bull, 115 bullets. Now we gotta go back to that save room. I'm using the alternate controls because the original controls are fucking terrible. Don't ever play this game with the original controls. Okay, let's drop this. Ah. This room is too small. Okay, give me the goddamn knife. I'll put the knife outside in the hallway. And there should be ink ribbons already in here. Where are they at? Where are they at? Oh, I'm standing on them. Oh, this is so frustrating. We'll go ahead and make a save. Let's run to fight a boss. I know I saved a lot. I saved like 11 times within like <laughs> two hours last night. Or yesterday, whenever that was. Okay, drop that. And outside we're going to leave the briefcase and the knife. to head back and fight the centipede. The bosses in this game are really fucking dumb. There's like a centipede, a scorpion. I said centipede, but this is a scorpion boss. Wait, uh, shit. This way. There's a scorpion, a centipede, a bat. Remember Resident Evil 2? The boss of the mad game? William Birkin's form, different forms. They were like completely original designs. In this game is just like, oh, let's take an insect and blow it up. Yeah, that'll work. That's one thing they love to do in this game, is put the fucking items next to something you can interact with. Okay, we'll take that. Fucking god. Okay, we'll take the shotgun. The shotgun shells. I didn't even see these shotgun shells. Last night, or yesterday. How much room do I have left? Oh my god, not enough. But we'll leave the first aid spray. And should I use a shotgun on this boss? Yeah, why not? You know what? I don't know. Let's flip a coin. Heads, the handgun, tails, shotgun. Well, 
I dropped it. Hold on. What I say? Hold on. Heads, the handgun, tails, the shotgun. Okay, handgun. So we'll leave you the shotgun here. The shotgun is terrible, by the way. You get a better one. And we'll take the first aid spray, just in case. And do I have the ice pick? Yes. Easier yesterday because his head was open. I don't know why it's not open right now. Okay, there it goes. It's got a cluster open, I guess. Oh, no, no, no. Well, what the fuck could I have done about that? Hold on, let's see. Hold on, he's gonna fucking rush at me. I think this is gonna reset his health, but I mean, he had me up against the wall, what can I do? Oh, he's still here. What can I possibly do against that? I think there's a way to do this with the knife. Probably the same concept. Doing that move, can't do anything against it. Oh. I died at this stupid boss when it cried. Ah. You dead? 
fucking danger. Oh no. Damn it. I got caught reloading. Alright, I'm using a shotgun this time. Resident Evil. Well, that's the first day. Zero. You have to sit through this slow text every time. Okay. I didn't read this. Investigation orders. Stained with blood. Some Texans are illegible. Eight miles north of Raccoon City in the Arclay Mountains lies our company's management training facility. It was shut down years. Ag. Now where? Conducting a preliminary tutty into the reopening of the facilities. First investigation unit is already on site and opening the investi invest investigation. We want your team to provide support. The following orders read Lillenbert Bark and uh, ones investigate out. The rest is totally unreadable. That was almost unreadable. Okay, this time the shotgun. The coin failed me. Other way. Right? No, this way. There's gotta be a better way to fight this thing. Cause it gets you up against the wall and it's like there's nothing you can do. I only have seven shotgun shells though, so I mean that's not really gonna do me any good. So, uh, let's just go with the handgun again. And this time I'll be more relentless. I'll, I'll shoot him. I'll shoot the rest of him. Until I get a chance to shoot. What do I got? Why do I have the knife? I was supposed to drop that stuff off. Shit. I'm a fool. Hold on. Resident Evil Zero. I didn't die to this boss yesterday. I didn't have any trouble with this boss at all yesterday. I like beat him with my eyes closed. Okay, let me grab that note. No. I'll use both. I'll take the shotgun and then switch over to the handgun. If I can hold that much. Yeah, I can. If all I need is to hold this. 
and the shoddy. I guess we'll leave the first aid spray. Actually, what I'll do is I'll turn around, come back in here, drop off the ice pick, and then pick up the first aid spray so I can have it on me. Because I don't know if when you leave the room, if it resets its health or not. Most of the time, that's the case. I wear it all that. First aid spray, I'm an idiot. Shit, I thought I reloaded. One last shot. actually the shotgun really did really did wonders all right give me this drop off the shotgun oh well, I don't need to pick it up god damn it oh my fucking god and that's another thing that's annoying about this game is it's so hard to pick up the shit on the ground that as far as I know if this is like remake there's no penalty for using um, first save sprays we do need this save room again. Oh my god. Put the shotgun outside. Or can I put it in here? Oh, of course. Actually, you know what? We don't need this shotgun ever again. We get a better one in the... What is that? The mansion? I don't know what it is. We'll get a better one there.
Okay. I'm going to take a little break. I'll be back in like five, five minutes. So hang tight.
are we doing? We beat the boss. But you gotta go free, Becca. So we gotta go this way, right? All the way back across the car. How much ammo did I waste doing that? Not much. Zombies. <laughs> okay, so we send up the ice pick. Yes. Now we can get out of here. We're free. Okay, get the hell out of here. There are so many zombies in this game, it's ridiculous. And they don't give you enough ammo to deal with them. This way. Okay. Okay, as I said earlier, we are gonna be playing as Billy. Becca. That's all she's gonna get. It's 15 bullets. We're gonna keep all. All of them. Okay, so now we're gonna use this. Over here. Metal Gear Solid 1. I should play that on stream. I love those games. I would consider the second one one of my favorites. Ow. Fuck. Hitting the dog. That would work. Anyway. I would consider the second Metal Gear Solid one of my favorites. But it's like, it's hard to consider it my favorite because I've never beaten it on European Extreme. Get that tobacco. I feel like I can't say it's my favorite because I've never beaten on European Extreme, so I should really try to do that. Oh, let's unlock that door. And grab this. I don't know why this would be here. Let's see what's out here. I can't remember. Oh yeah, this. Okay, so I can go over there. Whoops. Wrong button. I'll check it out. Okay. Can she even hold it? friends again. Let's head back and we gotta go use this hook shot to get on top of the car again.
get a little jump scare out here. Stay down. Uh, you go ahead and give me that. Change it for the shotgun shells, and we're probably gonna end up leaving a handgun somewhere. Spec is not gonna be shooting anything. Was that ammo back there? No. Just scenery, and I'm pretty sure more zombies are gonna pop up. Yes, of course. No, aim at that one. <laughs> I think next I'm going to do Code Veronica, because that's the other... I've never uh, finished that game. That's where we use this. I've never made it past the second disc of Code Veronica. Okay, so we gotta separate again. Now we gotta go back and get the briefcase. Because this is the other thing. Get me out of here. What's down here? Oh, I've already been in here. Hurry, 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 hurry. Send back up to grab that herb. Let's regroup. Okay. Uh, you go up there and grab that herb. Do you have space? Yes. Actually, you know what? Give me that. And you go up and grab that herb. We're doing way better than I was doing last time. Last time I used every herb I found as soon as I found them. Go, 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 go. Don't shoot that shit. Don't waste your ammo. <clears throat> I think they'll only shoot if you shoot. Uh, okay, so now we need to go grab the briefcase, which is... Behind us. God damn it. Let's 
said, there's so many zombies in this game, it's ridiculous. Okay, we're gonna leave the hook shot out here. So we're not gonna need it for a long time. We will need it again. And where's that briefcase? There it is. Have we done enough to warrant saving? I don't think so. I don't know though. I think we should. <clears throat> Cause I think next we have to go do the math puzzle, and I don't know how that's gonna go. I did it first try last time. Where's the ink ribbon? I hate this. I hate it so much. Okay, I should be standing right on top of it. There it is. I think I have one left. But there's more where we're going. Bullshit, I can't leave here. Oh my god. Get it the fuck out of my inventory. Okay, let's. Examine this. Open it up. This huge briefcase with just a little tiny card inside. Let's take a look at it. Look at that dude. He doesn't even look like a human being. He looks like... He looks like, uh... The Colonel from, uh... Metal Gear Solid 2. When he starts freaking out near the end. Jimmy Lewis! Okay, let's... Take this where we need to take it. Which is right around the corner. This way. Right. No, other way. Yeah, other way. Oh shit. Throw it away. This is Delta Team. This is Delta Team. We have gained control of the train. Over. Understood. This does not make any sense. How was the T-Virus leaked? And why did it contaminate both the lab and the mansion, as well as a train almost three miles away? That's irrelevant. We must make sure no knowledge of this gets out. Destroy the train. Completely. How far away are you from the nearest branch line? About ten minutes, to. Huh? <laughs> what happened? <laughs> Get leaked. Why can't I take their machine guns? But there's no way to fix it. AKA Billy doesn't know what he's doing.
The train will either derail or crash. I gotta stop this thing. Okay, we're not gonna that. Ah, oh, shit. I want to send Rebecca because she gets a unique cutscene, but she has no ammo. So, well, fuck it. We'll leave Billy. I think she gets. I'll go over to the back deck and manipulate the control panel for the. Think there's some ammo you in here. Stay here and apply the brake when ready. Okay. If not, what is load to save? Rebecca, do it again. Huh? Don't screw up, okay? I won't. Don't fuck up. Yeah, there's some ammo in here. I don't know if it's enough, but it's enough for killing the guy we need to kill. What? Why can't I carry? Oh no. Alright, let's hope it's enough. Let's hope my math is on point. Out of the way. I couldn't take the shotgun. Zombies in here. Fuck them. Ah, damn it. Knock them all down. Knock them all down. See, Becca takes one hit and she's down. You think that's enough zombies? Danger! You know what we have, uh. We have this. Caution. We have some more herbs. We'll be alright. Scene to play as Billy. Okay, he's done. We have six bullets left. Oh no, he's not! Okay, now he's done. Oh, I'm not even fucking with him. No more, please. Okay. So where do we go? Out this door, right? I think there's been more zombies on this train than there are in the entirety of the original Resident Evil game. Okay, here we go. And you left <laughs> this card. What? You left this card. You blocked. Okay, 67. 9, 18, 27, 36, 45, 54, 60. Two, four, seven. This is Rebecca. I have engaged the control device for the brake. Over. Roger. I'll put the brake on now. All right, now his is a little tougher. Nine, eighteen, twenty-seven, thirty-six, forty-five, fifty-four, sixty-three, seventy-two, eighty, one.
So you have to have at least pass the first grade to play this game. be quick about this. Where is the... We need the hook shot. Where is it? There it is. Get away from that shit, Becca. Grab this. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Feel like we're fucking around. another herb out there I wish I could have grabbed, but whatever, we'll be alright. It's just one herb. I know what's there if there's an emergency. <sighs> Whoops! Right back down on his head. Research Center? <gasps> the first general manager, Dr. James Marcus. Who on earth are those people? She's just a rookie, a member of STARS. Hmm, what about the male? I'm unfamiliar with Attention! Mm -hmm. This is Dr. Marcus. Please be silent as we reflect upon our company That's model. a cool shot. Obedience breeds discipline. Discipline breeds unity. Unity breeds power. Power is life. <laughs> who are you? It was I who scattered the T-virus in the mansion. Needless to say, I contaminated the train, too. What? Revenge on Umbrella. That voice totally does not match him. ago, Dr. Marcus was murdered by Umbrella. You helped them, didn't you? <laughs> okay. I didn't grab the ink ribbon, but whatever. There's only one left. We get three here. And let's drop some shit off over here. We're going to drop off this, and Becca's gonna drop off her handgun, this, this, and keep those for now, we'll get a shotgun soon. And we'll leave those there, I'll take the handgun ammo. Becca actually needs to heal, so... We use this herb. Okay, we are good to go. We're gonna save. And we'll start exploring this place. 
I don't remember exactly like the route to take through here, but we'll figure it out. Okay, we'll drop the ink ribbon here. I know where another ink ribbon is. Okay, first of all, I think we go in here. I know we're not. Alright, we're going to avoid going in here for now because something spawned in there that I don't want to mess with. Damn, he's fast. Keeps on caution from that little nibble. Okay. Becca is just worthless. I mean, I might as well just leave her. Handgun ammo, I'll take that. Anything else? Okay, nothing. I know this guy gets up. We can't go this way because there's steam. You don't go this way for a while. I remember. We didn't make it that far last night. Okay, I think this is the room where you get the shotgun. I know you're not dead. Shit scared out of me last night at this park because I didn't know that second zombie was there and I walked around the corner right into him. Okay, there's a shotgun. How much space do I have? One slot. Okay, we'll go back to the main hall and drop drop some stuff off. We got what we needed in here. I thought there was a ladder that led up in there. Let me go back in there and look. And we're probably just gonna leave Rebecca in the main hall until I need her. Yeah, there is a ladder. Oh god, there's like 20 zombies out here. That guy gets up if you go too far. Come on, Rebecca. Oh. Uh, Should have just gone back to the main hall. Aim at the dude that's close to you, please. some herbs here so back up pick them up and use one well fuck she needs 
We'll combine them and use them. I know it's a waste to do that, but I mean, is it really a waste? This is what was happening yesterday. I, I was having to use every herb I ran into. Because Becca gets hurt so fucking easy. Okay, this leads. And I didn't even need to come out here yet. You didn't even need to come. You didn't need to go out there. Because you come in here and you can get here from the main hall. So you don't even need to go out there. Well, I would leave Becca in the main hall, but I need her as a pack mule. Shotgun shells. I can pick that up. So now we have six or uh, five ink ribbons. What I do with the shot the other shotgun shells? I mean, she's got them, so I'll take those. And this black thing in here. Yes, we can. Okay, now we need to go... I think there's a door... There's another door in here. Which I'm sure has like 20 zombies in here. Yep. I mean, you think that's enough? This is the fire door. What's in here? What's in the box? Okay, so uh, we need to go back to the main hall. I could grab that. We'll need that later. Grab this. I think there's a document over here or something. Ooh, more ink ribbons, yes. Because I like to save a lot. And we have to send Becca. Because she can't operate the handle for some reason. To send her with the shotgun. Okay, let's go over here. I think the door is over here. We're gonna leave her out here. Oops. Let's split up. Roger. Okay, make sure you check the whole room because. There will be crows in here in a second. Notice to all staff, this document is very old, much of the writing is illegible. Regular meetings of the vaccine research and infectious agent teams will be held. Both meetings are security level 5 and will be held in the following locations. Blah 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 blah. 
Entry code will be 815. Thank you. Okay. I remember that from yesterday. Okay, so we're going to grab this. And quickly, please. Let's go drop some shit off. Come on. Okay. Okay. We will drop off. Well, we need the shotgun. So we'll drop off the ink ribbon and the microphone. Drop that off here. I just gotta remember to grab that before we go over there to do the thing. Because I forgot it last time they got me killed. And where's that ink ribbon? There it is. Pick that up. Whoops. Pick it up. Pick it up. And eh, uh, fuck it, we'll save. We've done a lot. Done a good bit. Killed a lot of zombies. I don't want to re-kill. Okay, let's go ahead and get her the shotgun. Shotgun shells. Not that you'll need the shells, but whoops. Okay, we're good. Let's head back upstairs. We'll get make Becca a quick shotgun so she can look like a badass. I want to see a speed run of this game because I want to know how they get around all these goddamn zombies. Because not only are there a lot of zombies, but they're put in positions to where you cannot like run around them. You have to fight them. It's the same thing in Code Veronica. Except in Code Veronica, you get plenty of ammo, from what I remember. In this game, you don't get nearly enough ammo. Over here, and let's I'll split up. Okay. Becky, you stand over here. Billy, you crank, and let's use it. And you're ready to fight some bugs. more okay that's another I don't know if I've said this yet but that's another problem with this game is that they love to put fucking items next to background shit you can inspect okay we can't do anything here yet please no zombies I think this there's only crows out here Yes. Okay. Which I mean they still suck, but get that, get that, get that. There's a red herb hiding right here. Go, 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 go. Okay, so now we're in this room. We're going to link ourselves back up. I only know this part of the game uh, well enough. Well, uh, pretty well. We can't get what's in this room right now because we don't have enough space. So we're going to go drop off, I guess. Well, fuck. I don't know what we're going to drop off. The herbs, I guess. Okay, 
Billy head back and reunite with Becca. Oh my god, I was, I was looking at something. I was looking at my OBS. I didn't even see him. I just ran right past him. My OBS said I dropped a little bit of frames. I was looking at that. I started dropping frames pretty bad last night, so if it happens again, I'll just have to... Stop the stream and restart it. Okay. Follow me. Yeah. Let's go drop off those herbs. Doing pretty good. Doing pretty good. Way much better than yesterday. Probably should have combined. Hold on. Let me combine these. Whoops. Give that to Billy. And give him the shotgun. And the shotgun shells. He's gonna need them. Because we have a... Um, I don't want to spoil it, but we have something coming up. That's gonna eat all of my ammo. Okay, let's go in here. Oh shit! Why did I do that? Motherfucker! I did not. I forgot we've got in here. Die, motherfucker! That scared me. Okay. Becky, okay, you grab that. Billy, you grab... Shelves. Oh my god. What did I say? What did I say? Okay, grab that. Don't forget the stores here. I never found, I didn't find the water motif last night, or the water key last night. Is there any way I can hold that grenade launcher? I don't think so. We'll just have to rely on the shotgun. Grenade launcher only has six rounds anyway. Okay. Here. I'll check it out. Let's go. Becca, you run over here. Let's go. No. I'll go check over there. Okay. Whatever you do, do not move. Because you will crush Rebecca. Pick it up. Pick it up. And we got the red key. Another dumb boss. Fucking centipede. Okay. 
to make sure I'm hitting it. It doesn't really, like, come after you. Oh my god, that's with that. Oh my god, hit it! Oh, no, 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 no. It will hit you if you get in front of it. Okay, let it come back around. Oh, I got it. Nice. Flawless. That did not go as well yesterday. I got hurt. Rebecca! Are you all right? Yes, thank you. Okay, so what did we just get? The key? So, um... One shot. Let's head back to the main hall. Uh, do I want to go out that door? I don't. I want to go out this door. I don't think there's any uh, stair skating in this game. No, there's not. Okay, let's drop off. Hold on. Put this up here. Bullshit. We don't need to use an owl. Now we're going to drop off the shotgun. Not here, because I'll, I'll have a hard time picking it up. We'll drop it off over here. Put that, what's the I got? Should drop off this. Give that to Billy. And let's save, because we just fought a boss. that door. I think it was in here. And I'm pretty sure this room repopulates. It does. Go, go, just go, just go. Fuck him. Ah, you could just climb to that little opening right there. Oh my god. Okay, what's in here? Lighter fluid. I know where we use that. And something, anything else? See, he could just climb right through that. There's a bottle. I don't fuck with the Molotov cocktails because they're just too, I don't know. I don't like them. Let's see if we can get out of here without this zombie grabbing us. Oh, he's over there. He's... He's not even concerned with us. He's probably pissing in that sink over there. Okay, so we just got lighter fluid. Let's combine that with this. And uh, where's that other door? Uh, 
Or was that the one? Another flame door. I see it. Probably more zombies in there now. Oh, there is one zombie in here, I remember. Because I just dodged by it. Okay, nice. Any more? Is there a new one around this corner? I don't remember what's in this room. I'm not expecting good things, so. Oh, this is the room where you push. Turn this on. And that will reveal. Disappear and shotgun shows. Get up there. Get up there. And the iron needle. We know where that goes. Well, I didn't show it, so. But it goes on a clock, which I don't remember how to get back to. Assistant di Director's Diary. September 2nd. A useless bunch of trainees, as always. Where does headquarters find these idiots? We did get a couple of decent ones, though, so I can't complain, I guess. William, William and Albert, they might have a future. September 25th. Scholar Will, Practical Al. They really are opposites. And they're always competitive in everything they do. There's something ruthless and cruel about them both. Dot, dot, dot. October 7th. Got a sudden call from the director. It was to tell me to encourage a rivalry between those two. It's the first time since this training facility was built that Director Marcus has ever shown interest in anything other than his research. Well, whatever. Orders are orders. I'm going to have them tearing at each other's throats. Okay, let's get out of here. Um, what should we deal with first? The lighter fluid or the... Or the uh, clock? We'll deal with the lighter fluid first. Is that in here? Yes. And I'm pretty sure there's a lot of zombies in this room. Or at least two. Rebecca, you, you stay. I'll go alone. Okay. Get up, fool. Ooh, grenade. And over here, we push this. Get this book. The good book. And if we examine it, whoops, not combine it. We get the white wings. We know where that goes. So let's head back to the main hall. Drop this shit off.
Come on. Okay. Regroup. Please, no zombies. This way. And I gotta remember how to get back to where the clock is. Where was that? Oh, that was up those stairs. Hold on, let's put, do this first. I can't hold that. Okay, so back up. Uh, we take these. Demon Queen. Okay, so where was that? Uh, in here. No, this leads back out in this room. Where was that? I and mean, not the map's gonna help, but. What's that? I remember I, it's where I sent her up. So where is that? Oh man, this map does not help. Oh man, it's thundering outside. Good, we need it. This, it was like a hundred degrees the last two days. Ah oh, man. Wait, is that it? No, that's not it. That fuck, where was it? Okay, wait a minute. We have to go back out where the crows were. Now I remember. Keep up, Rebecca. Get left behind. Come on, come on. Oh my god, the controls. Okay, it's in this room. And I think this is about as far as I got. After these white rooms, that'll be as far as I got, so we'll be back in unknown territory. Okay, so, 8.15. All the way down. I got fucked up on this last night and thought this was 8. Where I'm at now, I thought this was a because I because I haven't looked at a clock like this in a long time. Okay, so that should do it. Okay, let's head back to the main hall. And we're gonna save because this part's kinda hard. I died at this part a lot. I 
I've died a stupid amount of times to this part. Like, I think it was like three or four times I died. I had to re keep redoing it. Because at this point, I had no healing. We were both on... Uh, I think Billy was on danger. Rebecca was on caution. I had no healing. Yeah, I was in a bad, bad spot at this, this point to run last time. So we're doing a lot better. Now, I, I kept saying I wanted to restart the game and do it over again and do it better. So I'm glad I did this. Okay, the first door is over here. Zombie Central, I'm sure. Yes. Okay, hold on, no. Let's go save first. Well, no, we can do us in this room. I'm gonna leave Becca out here. I'll go alone. Okay. We'll save when we go to the other white door. Because the other white door is what got me killed over and over because of a certain enemy. Go down, go down. Oh my god. Yeah, there's a lot of them in here. Oh my god! Go down! Holy shit! Five fucking bullets. A verse of poetry. The moon bows to the earth, the earth swears loyalty to the sun, and the great law of the sun governs all things. This itself is a keystone, the pointer to glory. All our hands cannot open the doors of the heaven. I have no idea what that means. Just your uh, standard cryptic Resident Evil bullshit. And there's also this. We need this. No, not the fucking fireplace. And please let there be ammo in here. No, I know we're we're about to get 30 shots. If I have enough to clear out that room, I don't. So we're gonna need to take the shotgun. Oh because we're about to hit a room full of zombies. Come on. Okay. And I need to clear it out because there's 30 handgun ammo, handgun bullets in there. So let's take the shotgun. And I think Becca has some ammo. Or do I have it all? I have it all. Okay, you drop that. And we're gonna save, because this part's kinda tricky. Like I said, I died like four times at this part. Might leave Becca here. No, we need the other microfilm. Pick it up. Pick it up. We have plenty of healing items, so we should be good. Uh, okay. Yeah, I'm gonna leave Becca out here. I'll go alone. Okay. There's a reason I saved this. This room for last. I'm gonna not even go in that room. There's two herbs in, in there, but I'm just gonna leave them. And I really need these handgun am handgun bullets. Whoa! No, damn it. That was really stupid of me. But Billy's really resilient. Okay, so let's use... Whoops. Ah, fuck me.
Okay. And there are 30 handgun bullets right there. Pick it up, please. Right, that better be 30. I'm pretty sure it's 30. Yes, it is. Okay, so we're back to being fully stocked. Thank God I needed that. And huh, this is the tough part. Okay, good. Yeah. Last time he was already, because I had already gone in there, he was already spawned. And he was like, in motion. But since I, that was the first time I went in there, he was in the middle of spawning so I could run around him. Alright, I need one of these herbs. Ah. Uh, what can I do? Drop a shotgun. Please pick it up. Quit fucking with me, Billy. And we're about caught up to where I was. Let's regroup. Okay. We'll do this and then we'll save again. And then after this, it'll be back to being blind. So. Two D. That's what it was like yesterday. Okay, so. Two, and then D. Okay. All right, I'll stand at this one. I'll go alone. Roger. And then D was down here. Let me check. Oh man, the, it's the other one, right? This one? That's right, right? And we'll find out, whatever. Okay, you push that. Push that, and we did it. And I think we'll get. Oh man, we got. No, we're not caught up yet. Okay, so regulations for trainees, training facility mission. The training facility will raise a new generation of model employees to serve the future of Umbrella Corp. Applying the strictest and most rigorous training standards, this facility will, without regard for gender, race, or creed, produce only the best candidates to be the future global leaders of Umbrella Corporation. We look forward to the development of your leadership qualities. Training facility guidelines. Discipline, obedience, unity. These three words are the basic principles which govern Umbrella Corporation employees and are to be considered the law of this facility. Keep these words in mind at all times. Devote yourself to your training and bring honor to yourselves and the corporation. James Marcus, blah, 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 blah. Okay. Follow me. Yeah. And we're gonna... We'll go to this one first. Did we just save? Yeah, we just saved. Oh. 
20 zombies. Good thing we just got all that ammo. Motherfucker! I didn't think it was that fucking close. Man, we're already eating through that shit. Alright, what's down here? Okay, I remember this room. Ah, uh, I don't think we need to be in here yet. We'll come back. First, let's check out this other room. I think this is the room with the chest piece. The chest staying on the ground. How much would it have cost to build this? I will take those, definitely. Okay, uh, I have a picture of this on my phone. Let me grab my phone. There it is. I was like, where is it? It's in my pocket the whole time. Okay. Uh Okay. So you need to push this one. Okay, let, let me show you like what the uh solution is. It's this. You got to get it in checkmate. I don't know how to play chess, so I need this. I fucked up what it be if you needed to know how to play chess. It already requires you to know how to add and multiply, I mean. And I think... Move, Rebecca. Okay. So now we get the evil book. And this is as far as I made it. Marcus's Diary 1. Oh, this one's really long. December 4th. We finally did it. The new virus. We've caught it the Progenitor. I want to carry it back and start detailed investigations immediately. March 23rd. Spencer says he's going to start a company. Well, I don't care. As long as I can continue my research into Progenitor. He can do what he likes. August 19th. Spencer keeps asking me to be the director of his new facil training facility. Maybe it's because of the business, but he's becoming intolerably, intolerably pushy. But maybe I can turn this into my advantage. I need a special facility to properly explore all this virus secrets. A place where no one will get in the way. November 30th. Damn, that's Spencer. He came to, climb, he came to complain to me again today. He thinks of progenitor as nothing more than a money-spinning tool. Fool! But if his influence continues to grow, it can only be bad for my research. If I'm to properly develop progenitor, I must strengthen my own position too. September 19th, at last. I've discovered a way to build a new virus with progenitor as a base. Mixing it with leech DNA was a breakthrough I needed. I call this new virus T for Tyrant. October 23rd. It's no good! I can't hope for real progress experimenting on mere rodents. Only humans can be a proper mammalian subject for the experiments. Otherwise, I'll never make any real progress. Ugh. November 15th. Someone seems to suspect something about my experiment, but perhaps it's my imagination. Well, if anyone does get too close, they may find themselves unexpectedly assisting in my research. 
January 13th. At last, they are ready. My wonderful legions. Those of low intelligence will never have the privilege of tasting the sense of joy and satisfaction. Now finally I can move against Spencer. Soon, I will control everything. Dot dot dot. January 31st or still more. The devices I set to protect my work have been disturbed. It appears someone came looking for tea and the leeches. Fool. No doubt the work of Spencer's group. February 11th. Today I've again found evidence of tampering around the entrance to the labs. If this is what they are after, I must find a suitable way to deal with them. Perhaps I should have William and Albert smoke out the pest. Those two are the only ones I trust, apart from my love, beloved leeches and progenitor, of course. But Spencer, it wouldn't end there, would it? I will announce tea at the next director's meeting and collect my just rewards. Why would you announce that to anybody? When I just think you're a psychopath? Out of the way, Rebecca. Anything else in here? Ooh. Ooh. Grab that. Um. Once again, putting it next to something. Napalm grenades. And ink now let's go deal with those zombies in that room. Get up. That sounds like death to me. Okay, what do we got? I think there's herbs. It's blue herbs, which I don't even really need. First aid spray. Okay, Rebecca. Do your thing. And we're going to take this. There should be a document in here. Yeah, there it is. Ah, oh, motherfucking god. First investigation unit notes. We are searching the facilities and it looks like a lot of the chemicals survived. Fortunately, the storage tanks are still all full. We have just started and there is still a lot we don't know. But it appears the chemicals can be mixed to produce new substances. The chemicals are scattered all about, not because of the accident, more as a result of plain mismanagement. When we reopen the facilities, we will have to develop a system for dealing with these chemicals. Something gets scrawled on the back of the note. Red plus blue equals blah 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 blah. Okay. And did I take this? I did, right? Yeah, I did. Okay. So let's head back to the main hall. Never be too sure. And this is the furthest I made it. Once we set this, uh... Once we set this onto the scale, that will be the furthest I made it. So the rest will be blind. Well, I mean, blind... Since my childhood. I've played this game here and there, this is the furthest I've made it in a long time like since I was a kid so it will be uh, semi-blind I've watched videos of other people playing though so it looks like a Titan demon okay so now we balance the scales and that will open up the picture. And 
and we're going to save. And we have all these uh, new avenues open to us. Where's the other ink ribbon? I guess I never put it back. Right. There, yeah, at eight. So but let's let's drop off some shit first. We'll drop off these. We'll put these blue or well, don't I have a mix of red and green somewhere? Where are they at? What is this? Okay, yeah. So let's mix those blue herbs with this. Or one of the blue herbs. Okay. So let's put it back down. And leave this here too. Oh, I didn't even see this door over here. I can't leave any more items in this room. Is that what it said? Okay, so, well, damn. What can I... I'm gonna take... I'm gonna take this. And I'm gonna put it in... This room over here. I'm gonna put it in this room. Well, I really need two slots, or two spaces. So let me take something else. That I'm not really using. Uh, this. Pick it up. We will need this eventually. I remember that. That's something you don't forget. You need it like way later. We'll put these two in this room. So I can have space to put that first aid spray. And the other blue herb and that'll be it for that room we'll start using this room as our next dumping ground and well those five bullets would be nice to use but fuck it okay she has first aid or that all right we'll go back in here and dump this stuff out and then we'll save, and I'll probably call it there for today, and pick it up again next time. Okay. So let's put this here. This here. Oh no, now we can't put the increment down. You know what, we'll go save in the other room. I don't know why they put two typewriters, like, right beside each other. It's weird. do it for today we caught up with ourselves we caught up with ourselves um next time we'll examine the rest of those sword doors and progress anyway uh let me see i don't think anybody watched me on twitch today so Hopefully so, this will be for the people who watch on YouTube. Thanks for watching. And uh, yeah, later.